I'm going to hear from Dr. Osakpama Agbons, make he enlighten us on that matter, uh, because he don't test the two sides. Uh, doctor, good morning. Uh, good morning, my brother. Uh, Ekanem, how, how your side? Uh, you don't hear me clearly, so. I didn't hear you. Hope you didn't hear me for that side. Uh -huh. uh, doctor, you don't come, you don't come, bro. Uh, like you will wait for since make you tell us. You see the matter now they talk about so brain drain for Nigeria. Uh, what is that UK world well, of the all the doctors and even the way they claim for hospital, they won't run go there, won't call do the work there for abroad. My, my brother, you know, say the, the, the last time when I come this your program, I tell you say uh, 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 hierarchy. Okay, we talk about the three basic uh needs of any human being which is food clothing and shelter so and uh, when you look that pyramid at the top you go see luxury there at the at the top there so every human being one day comfortable nobody they want to hala i even sure so even you yourself you know you 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 like comfort now so all of us be as a human being so when it can reach this issue of uh doctors or other professionals where they come up for nigeria not be today this thing starts you remember this uh andrew one checkout that time when would they when would they young when would they hear that thing for nta that time all of us know now so everybody want um whether you they walk or uh, because of your family you want to where you go feel live comfortable so me i feel saying that that be the major thing and another thing where they if you be professional you want me you get uh, the tools where you go take work. So, all these things, they contribute. Nigeria, our healthcare system, they're very poor. They contribute. When they make our medical practitioners, they come up for Nigeria, they go UK, they go Canada, they go uh, America, not the other place. Investigation shows, say, uh, doctors for Nigeria, uh, they require to, when they go there, they, they would have private hospital, they, they feel work. And uh, the condition that they allow them to work for national health services, and uh, ninety-two percent of the people they recruit for for uh, for UK will be Africans. It shows that eighty-one percent be Nigerians. Uh, the salary there, how the salary be compared to Nigeria, apart from the working environment, how the salary be for that area? You yourself do not say the salary. It they big. The salary they big. Where, where they end, not be say just stay big like that, too. But there are other things where, where they make life they comfortable, where, where they make people they come up for Nigeria. Maybe we not even talk about doctors, even bankers, engineers, IT experts. All of them, they they, they jack banner. All of them, they, 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 they travel, they come out. Even academics, you know, people they come out, you know, lecturers and all that. So now the a uh, condition of service and the, the environmental situation i right? neither cost most of this uh you know brain drain where would they get for 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 nigeria i make i just talk something here because like you talk just now me i they do research so and if you be researcher you go no say na, na number now you would take work maybe be our bread and butter for research so if you look nigeria our population our estimated population we are about 200 million and World Health Organization talk and say, for if a country's healthcare system, my brother, today effective, one doctor to 600 patients. This is now World Health Organization, United Nations organ. I will then talk with that. But if you look Nigeria, now we get a situation where we say one doctor to about 10,000 patients. How you see that kind of thing? And then if you look Nigeria, when to read medicine for Nigeria, now six years you go spend for medicine. Oga, okay, okay, wait first. You say one doctor to how many patients for Nigeria? To six to six hundred. Now United Nations uh, World Health Organization WHO put for grant and that is at the global standard with that. But for Nigeria, now one doctor to ten thousand patients. Nigeria. Okay. So if yeah, for Nigeria, if you look nurses according to uh, WHO standard, now one nurse to five patients. But for Nigeria, now one knows to 1,160 patients. So when you look at the, the, the workload itself, the, the, the stress with for our uh, our medical practitioners, the, the thing too much. And if you even stretch out 
pharmacist, now the same thing, laboratory scientist, physiotherapist, radiographer, you know, all these other people where they work for inside hospital. That one are part of the problem. And the major one, we can they make our uh, young doctors, where they make them even the jackpot, the major one, my brother, now where to train. You know, say when, like our, they talk now, after six years, when you graduate from medical school, get your MBBS. For Nigeria, you know, say not be even six years for public university. People, they graduate eight, nine years because of strike. You, they laugh. You, uh, know, you know everything now. You know everything now. I heard, so you, you need to do a uh, residency that would one way would they call housemanship for most of our doctors when they graduate to even get hospital where they go do housemanship because for that housemanship they go allocate you to one consultant we go be like your mentor mm. you know we go guide you so that you yourself go come also turn to a uh, consultant for Nigeria to come be consultant some doctors they take them like nine years 12 years 13 years to finish their residency and to become, you know, time go, they go. Some some of them, they go graduate from medical school one year, two years, three years, and they find where, where they will do housemanship. Young young person, we don't take, don't read book, only head, don't the hurt. If it's the opportunity to Japan, go Canada, or UK, America, my brother, if not, you, you, you not go work. Uh, but for now, look then, <clears throat> me, wait, why you ask that kind of question? You know, why you ask that kind of question? Now? I don't understand. <laughs> Listen, you know where I did now? You won't ask me, I'm going to expose my secrets. <laughs> Uh, but for you, where they there? You see, say this thing where House of Reps they try to do now. If it reduce the amount of medical practitioners where they won't travel abroad to go uh, seek for greener pastures, there. My brother, I, 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 I believe say so you they watch a uh, new masquerade. Chief Zebodaya, Mkori Mbuewobo, alias 430. This thing where uh, Honorable Ganil Johnson for House of Rep for Abuja, where you did so, where he bring. Not be the way to take soft problem. You know, sometimes when I just look at Nigeria matter, my brother, we, 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 Nigeria, we, they like to live for every matter. Not be even only for healthcare. Nigeria, Nigeria, uh, all these politicians, they go live disease. They go, they chase a uh, symptom. Which can be in the introduce so? Is that what, that, now what you go do be that? They don't go solve the problem with they for our healthcare system. Now then they're supposed to start. So this be when they bring say uh, uh, um, our medical student when they graduate from public university that they must work five years. That not be the way to solve this problem now. So in suppose you know they suppose sit down with the Nigerian Medical Association, the Nigerian uh, Dental Association, and all the healthcare uh, Nigerian Association of uh, Nurses and Midwife, uh, the, the Pharmacy Council of Nigeria. Uh, laboratory scientists, all these medical and allied professionals, they will sit down with them. We all know the problem for our healthcare, say, now, now lack of facilities and then uh, lack of uh, resources. Even according to uh, World Health Organization, according to United Nations, self, how much uh, government supposed to the budget for health? Not, not be not be twenty five percent for for Nigeria. You know, they even they reach five percent with government they budget every year for health. And even the five percent with them go budget, the money not they come out. Even when the money come out, some people then, then, then go chop them. So this one way just go they bring be now to leave the cause of a problem, go they scratch uh, the surface. He not try at all. And you can see the way where all Nigerians they condemn this B when they try to introduce. And this B, as far as many of us they concern, it is dead on arrival. It not go fly. Nigeria House of Representatives. And I want you to suggest me that. But for you, where they there now for there for UK? You see, I say the UK government because I only read one article where they, they spot Nigeria there among the red lights with a uh, red flag where they say they don't want too much because of cement. our own health uh, health sector here. Uh, we need more people. Uh, I say I did the article. I don't forget the place you write the article. But you where they there? You they see any sign of say uh, that they tried to say they don't want Nigerian medical practitioners again? Since they make that uh, statement here for Nigeria. Yeah, now, now last week, now last week, the nine that paper come out. Uh, about, not be only Nigeria, about 53 countries, now it did there, where they give a red flag. Say, we, our healthcare personnel, no even reach. You see the figure where I give you just now, now. Say, one doctor to 10,000 patients. When the global standard is supposed to be one doctor to um, 600 patients. So, 
now you make that uh, red flag with them put for Nigeria. But now UK. So, uh, although many people they say, uh, it be like say, say UK authorities, they don't they do some agomago with uh, uh, Nigerian people. It can't be like a case of a witch cry yesterday evening. Picking the people say, I can't be saying now when this man bring this beef for House of Red. Now in UK they put uh, put us for red flag, say our head personnel no rich. So, People they get that argument, but the way we may look and be say, if you notice, it's in the last two years uh, after the uh, pandemic, the COVID nineteen pandemic, the UK health system don't recruit about uh, I think about ten thousand eight hundred and ninety four um, Nigerian doctors. Now register, now don't they register here according to the statistics when they release last year. I think around uh, October 2022. So, which is a lot where they don't give license. And many still they come. And make I just talk something, uh, EK, here. For every one doctor with the jackpot from Nigeria, now three nurses, three to five nurses, now also the jackpot. So, make, make we know that one. And I saw pharmacists, now so that they come out. I saw laboratory scientists, now so that they come out. Doctors with the year. So, this thing. With the yes, only doctors. Yes. So but nurses they follow. Yes. Oh yes. I say for every one doctor, you know, three to five nurses now also they come out. Ha. So we, we, we really did. so that red flag where they put so they uh, make those all those agencies where they go recruit doctors and nurses and uh, healthcare professionals from Nigeria, make them they recruit the one the one stop and make them they recruit for Nigeria. Um People they look and say it be like say some synergy day between uh, Nigerian government officials and some some UK officials here, but we don't know how that matter take. We can't be like saying at this time we say somebody don't they uh, use B, then they put the flag. So the thing get that to be. But like I tell people, if for now UK put any flag, people go then go Japan, go Canada, go America. But me are not really feel say they right to restrict people movement. Everybody get in life to live. Hmm. Uh, doctor, experience say uh, you school for Nigeria, you school for Dokpo Law, you school for Nigeria small before you can't travel, go abroad, and uh, now go there as researcher. Uh, what do you feel say we need to get right? What will make us? Because we talk here, if, even if we carry ship now, keep for Kuba River, or keep for Via River, or keep for Hawaii River, or keep for Jabi Lake, or keep for River Ninja. So if you want to go to abroad now, uh, either you won't go work for cocoa farm, you won't go work for sugar cane farm. Come here, people will see us go. What thing we never get right? We make us no one stand fit for Nigeria. Yes, we will make our country better. Why? What be the problem? Uh, you, you yourself know now. Nigeria problem. Leadership. They do things properly. See the election we we do now. See all this. People they fight and uh, make uh, the, the referee will oppose the election, they don't even follow their rules. So, Nigeria just uh, people just they laugh us. So, for me, in our leadership, if we get our leadership right, all the sectors for Nigeria, not just healthcare, even education, aviation, housing, power, like this electricity thing, everything will do okay. So, now leadership, we so we need to have the right leadership. I don't believe say Nigerians they that difficult. If leadership they okay, eh, people go flow. The Nigerians go, everybody go, they go believe their leaders and the leaders self they sincere and truthful and honest. The, the country go it go better. But until we solve that uh, leadership problem, my brother, uh, are they afraid to tell you say uh, we get a very little for Nigeria? Ask you question, we could hear from them. Hello, good morning. Hello, good morning. What will be, what will be your name? Where they call us from? I bet when you want call, reduce the volume of your television set uh, so that uh, we don't go there and hold back sound. Okay. Okay. You say you call from Kujé? Yes, sir. Okay. Talk. Mm. 
Oh God, everything not fall apart. Nothing, they will not fall apart. We see they try to get and write. Yeah, more with the speakers our mouth, they talk good things concerning our country, Nigeria, small, small. And now they talk to so the number where they show for your screen. That same number where they call, where they send WhatsApp message to, where they tell me, say, fire the cashier. They don't rape one small girl. Uh, this one don't happen. Now that same number, you still tell us, say, bros, I bet. See my small business, yo. Uh, Monaco advertiser for inside on a program so that uh, the program go, they go. You understand? Because as we do, so now one, one leg with the star. This uh, money no be here. You understand? Uh, we still here uh, with Dr. Tony Osakwama at Bounce. Uh, we did for the United Kingdom as a researcher. Uh, he did, he's still there on air with us to make sure he tell us reasons why uh, it be like this. Why Nigerian medical practitioners, they run, come up for a year. Uh, if now you, uh, with what you don't talk, says, if now you, they the condition of those medical practitioners. With the workload here, they too much. You go to consider the same thing. You understand? Uh, but Nigeria has done the call since uh, to one make one or two contributions. I pretty made the network done stable now. Hello, good morning. Good morning. What will be your name and where you call us from? Um, my name is Celeste. I'm calling from Jua. Okay, Celeste from Jua. Make your contribution. Hello. You know, hear me? Reduce the volume of your television. Yeah, it's on mute now. Okay, make your contribution. Okay, just like um, what my doctor is saying, I want you to know that this is our. Uh, a very important issue that we really need to tackle, and I like this program. Thank you very much, bro. If the government cannot bring a lasting solution to this problem, I would want you to know that Nigeria will be a country here. You will not have any doctor that will repent. God forbid, oh, God forbid. Not the, which guy pray I'll be that one. I want you, that is just, that is just the truth. Now, take, take a good look at it this way. When the government perceives who we have elected to represent us in all ratification of life. In the aspect of medical, if they are sick, they fly themselves abroad to go and get adequate treatment. And whereas we that are citizens here, we cannot get the adequate treatment. Even hmm. the money in question is problem, lack of employment and everything. What do you expect the citizens to do? They also follow the step of the leaders. So the leaders are running out to seek for the better life. The citizens to follow the brother to seek for a better life. And check the unemployment issue. The politicians are there dragging office, dragging contract and all that, enriching themselves, keeping money for children. What about the masses? What about the masses? Uh, but uh, when they come campaign for our area, uh, we not ask them, say, oh God, if you seek, Hope say you not go go abroad though when you be governor or when you be senator or when you be president. We ask them those questions. Now my own be that. Uh, Dr. Tony Osakama, why are you still there with us? I want make I want to ask you this question. Uh when are they there for UK? When you know they see our senators, our House of Friends members, our governors, our friends with the political offices, when did they come abroad for medical checkup? When are they tell them say why they not feel repair our own hospital here for Nigeria? My, my brother, uh like I talk at the beginning of this program, Nigeria matter now, the more you look, the less you see. Um, we, we deter them. Okay. And even many Nigerians, they not only for UK here, for America, Canada, they are even trying to, you know, form a pressure group, you know, okay. to, to tell even this uh, foreign government here to prevent these, our people, from accessing medical care. But there are a lot of legal issues where they around that Involve. matter. Because like this, our brother we call just now, like we didn't talk. Somebody they now they talk, say, uh, you leave medical school, you must work five years for, for Nigeria, if at all you want travel. But this same politician get a headache. He don't enter plane. If they go America, they go UK, they go Canada. He won't want, want go check uh, himself. You know, from the president down. So, and Many of us don't be talking for a long time until there is a law in Nigeria we will prevent all these uh, politicians and politically exposed people uh, from assessing uh, health care abroad. Nigerian health care system not go settle. The same thing for education. If there is a law we will make it possible say so their children not go fit in Oxford and Cambridge and uh, they go and all the rest. They no go also repair our universities because the thing not they affect them. 
just like waiting this call and talk just now. Because imagine our president now, where, where they come out next month. That man, if you look in tenor of HS, about one year, now UK, now they look after himself. You, you know, see, as the man has become strong now for this in, in the last uh, two, three years. You know, see, as uh, the president Buari become strong. In the, in the move around, the man can uh, help. Uh, uh, do doctor, so what you know, they try to talk, they be like, say, the doctor is there. You see, say, the sharp pass, there's a like, no book pass us. I don't understand. No, no, no. They, they don't know book pass us. Not the facilities, my brother. Not the facilities. Look, may, may I tell you something? This is my personal experience. And I want to talk and make people hear. When I get uh, my relative, when, 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 oh, where, you know, they, they, you be church for, for Bini. Okay. Okay. We want to do, want to do test. Okay. Me, I did. I, 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 I this one will be said and tell me. I was, I did you be church. I did there. We take, we take in blood sample. And the, the, the doctor, they tell me, say, ah, he say, my brother, uh, this uh, sample now, nah, nah, I no go now. Nah, we go send and go one private uh -huh. lab, just to just to do test. So, I they tell you, so that's why I work at, post that sample with DHL. You know, do a return post. That's why we send the the, the sample go and no go. Then after uh, some days, the result can come back from any good to business. Now, nah, in nah, a private lab, now nah, I can say, why do not get this? Uh, this uh, machine we go fit test this equipment we go fit test this uh, he said they don't get and they they they, they, they don't get and the one we then get don't spoil tt it has not been replaced in fact that doctor even tell me say say my brother i say sometimes say in the nearly cry here say because they don't get equipment with we 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 ain't go take look after a patient he can't tell me say say i seen this so they even get opportunity so he said he go go saudi arabia or if go even go america making go the work say because he no one make it be say impatient go they die because of lack of facility. Simple, simple facilities we don't get them. And if you even look and say the number of hospitals where we even get, they no reach. And that is why we they get problem to see where to train all these uh, resident doctor for their housemanship and all these things. And the problem where would they get with that? Hmm. Uh, my country, one of the year uh, when they come campaign for to us for our villages to our states. Make we not just collect rice and beans and noodles and uh, seasoning. Make we ask them this simple question. Oh, guy, you are picking go school with me. First, let me say one person go one baby here. He go go abroad, go back here, come back. So go one watch Chelsea match. They go go rush, go watch Chelsea match, come back. Meanwhile, yeah, we not go get lights, but they'll go watch our life. And all this number we put up for our mind though. Not be only not too young to run B, not too young to run B. In that show, we call them, sit them down for table. They'll sit down for Joko. We'll go ask the question. So, God, I beg, nobody will be grandma. Tell us for the long way we will understand. Your children go school abroad. You go, go show which hospital you get card for Nigeria. Make we know all these things. Because if you continue to the romance of this man, when they speak, enter. Eh? May I just quick talk something? Because we'll okay. talk now. If you even look this, how these are politicians, when they come here, come take treatment. My brother, now Nigerian nurses, Nigerian doctors. Now they even look after them. But what will be the difference? Equipment day, we go fit it, check body, check blood, check water, check uh, you know the body chemistry, the physiology, and all that. Equipment day. Why the they fear? Day. Why the they fear? Say these Nigerian doctors now, where they run live here, and then go meet there. The they fear. Just show you, sir. So because equipment, not not that no facilities. And if you look, if you look like uh, UK where I did here, so hospital everywhere. And and one thing for healthcare, you get the one where they call primary healthcare. Like uh, here, we they call a GP GP. Not be everything person go the wrong go hospital. Because when you look at health, my brother, now prevention now it matter. So before sickness go come gather for body, you go tackle them. So our own, if you ask me now, primary healthcare, where we they? Most of the primary healthcare centers for Nigeria, they know they work. So if so you just go there, maybe you just see uh, uh, yeah, in a container. So in the, they know they work. Nothing did there. You don't go see doctor there. You don't go see nurse there. Because most of them, the place dirty. We they see all these things now. So primary health care day, secondary health care day, then tertiary health care. But for Nigeria, we, we know arrange them. So mm. our health care system needs, they need to declare emergency for our health care sector. Not be to introduce B with this uh, uh, Ghanaian Johnson. In, in no serious at all.
Uh, Dr. Dr. Tony Osakpama Agbons, I will thank you very much for, you don't really 